I've got two questions for you. Question number one, can you speak another language? And question number two, are you currently advertising in Google? If you answered yes to those two questions, you have a serious competitive advantage that you might not be taking advantage of right now. I'm gonna show you in this video how you can use language targeting to reach customers in a whole new way on Google AdWords and dramatically reduce your cost to do so. So I'm gonna jump into the Google Keyword Planner and show you what it is exactly that I'm talking about. Let's get started. I'm gonna show you guys some real examples of how AdWords language targeting is so powerful and how you can really reduce your cost and find another way to reach users. So the example I'm gonna show you here is divorce attorneys. So if you look down here at this keyword I have selected, divorce attorney, it says the estimated top of page bid. So if you wanna be on the top of the page when someone searched divorce attorney, it, you gotta spend $35.03. And, and this is based on all locations. Now, let's go ahead and see how much it would cost to reach somebody who's looking for a divorce attorney, but in this example, Spanish. So one thing to note is if you are gonna target another language, you have to make sure that your ads, your keywords, and your landing pages are in the language of the person you're trying to reach. So in this example, we're gonna do Spanish. So we wanna make sure that we have an ad that is in Spanish, a keyword in Spanish, and the landing page in Spanish. So we're gonna go ahead and put a divorce attorney, but in Spanish. So this is how you say divorce attorney in Spanish. And let's go ahead and search that and see how much this is gonna cost us. So to reach somebody looking for a divorce attorney in Spanish, it's only gonna cost us to be on the top of the page $4.88. That's crazy. If we wanted to reach somebody looking for a divorce attorney in English, it was gonna cost us $36. Can you guys see the power of language targeting? And if you're wondering, well, why is that? Why is it that it's more expensive to reach people in English than it is in Spanish? And the reason is everyone is only bidding on English. The level of competition is so much lower in other languages. So if you understand how to speak a different language, you have a huge competitive advantage. Now, there's one to 10,000 average monthly searches of people searching for divorce attorneys in Spanish. Think about how much business that can generate for you and the returns you can get. So this same process can apply to different types of keywords for different businesses. I just wanted to use divorce attorney as an example here, but this can apply to other languages as well. You know, um, if you speak Arabic, French, anything, any other language, you can do this same process. Just remember, you have to have the keyword, the ad, and the landing page all in the language that you are trying to target. Now, there are some negatives, though, when it comes to language targeting. And the only real negative when it comes to language targeting is your volume is going to drop off significantly. More people search in English than they do other languages. But with language targeting, you can reach people a lot cheaper and actually increase your conversions. So it's a small price to pay. You won't be able to reach as many people, but the people you do reach, you'll reach them for a lot less. Okay, now that I've hopefully sold you on the benefits of language targeting, you're probably wondering, okay, Silvio, this is amazing. Language targeting is awesome. I want to do this, but how do I actually do it? So I'm going to actually walk you step by step how to create a campaign and set the language that you want to target. So just go ahead and go to your AdWords dashboard, and you're going to go ahead and click on this blue plus button, and you're going to click New Campaign. In this case, for the example, we're going to create a campaign without a goal. We're going to create a search campaign. We're going to hit Continue. And now, when you scroll down and you're going and choosing your campaign settings, down here at languages, this is where you're gonna choose what language you wanna target. So we're gonna go ahead and delete English, and we're gonna go ahead and search for Spanish. There you go. And now this campaign is actually targeting Spanish. So then once you finish all your other campaign settings, and you have it how you like, you just click save and continue, and then now you're actually targeting people in Spanish. 
And again, remember, now that you're targeting people in Spanish in this example, make sure you're using keywords that are in Spanish, your ads are in Spanish, and the page you're sending your traffic to is also in Spanish. That's it for this video. If you got some value, please go ahead and feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for future content on AdWords, Facebook, and pay-per-click advertising.